a juice bar, if you've been to a smoothie bar, if you've seen, you know, the professional bartenders, this is the professional's choice. Power processing performance, a brand name that we know and love and a price that we are doing for this hour. Remember, this is the final Blend Tech show. Free shipping, a little over $50 gets it at home. And remember, this is the final opportunity. We are including almost $200 worth of bonuses. Actually, the additional carafe that I will show you in just a moment is normally a separate purchase. Shane, I gotta tell you, we love Blend Tech. We love that name. Well, I, I promise we'll shut her down. <laughs> because the thing is, if it doesn't have power, it's not a blend tech, right? It's not a blend tech. We you are correct. I love this brand name. Hey, by the way, Brandon, I won't walk over there right now, but we can show the colors before they sell out real quickly. We do have that beautiful, I think we're calling it orchid, that lovely kind yes, of plum. The purple. Uh -huh. So that was exclusive to HSN. We've got that gorgeous red. Black is always a safe bet. That wonderful turquoise with the white. And then, of course, the white itself. Oh, you know what? I'm actually, the, the, we're calling it polar in the inventory, or in the system. Sorry. I changed my mind. You said, Shane, $120 upgrade with that additional $130 carafe? actually, oh, $130 yes. $130 upgrade. So Shane's going to give you all the details. Shane, let's back up for a moment. Yeah. I, it, for people who are not in the know, which by the way, you've been with the company for eight years, so you know your uh -huh. stuff and then some. Yeah. Why is Blendtec such a well-regarded and known brand? What are some of the things that make them special and different? Well, they are synonymous with commercial, high-performance, industrial-grade blenders. So if you go to your favorite smoothie bar, coffee shop, any of those different places where you're buying your favorite smoothies or drinks that are usually made in a blender, you're going to see it with a Blendtec. So if you see these square jar designs, mm -hmm. you're typically going to be looking at a Blendtec blender there. Okay. Now, Blendtecs are synonymous with high performance. Now, what we just did here really right away was something that was very different difficult for regular machines. Right. You probably saw on TV that I just threw all frozen strawberries oh, and a bunch did. of ice. That is blender killer. It, it we is wanted a to show that killer. right away just because I want you to see the consistency here okay. already on the first blend. Now, typically with cheap blenders, if you see that kind of uh, thick or you know really dense material like frozen strawberries, for instance, or ice, you're going to get clumps, you're going to get chunks. Oh, for sure. This is a perfect blend. Everything is very, very consistent. It is. That is the reason why those smoothie bars and those coffee shops use a blend That's tech machine. That's why they rely on it. Is because of the consistency you and the what? durability. Let's make some more goodies here. Hey, if you have it, when you got it, when it told, sold out as a Today's Special, as I did, oh, sold out early, by the way, we would love to say hi to you. We'll show you that if purchased separately real yeah. quick. Quickly because Blendtec did something for us that they don't do for anybody else. That $130, that specially designed carafe, which is going to make you nut butters, which <laughs> yeah. I'm in love with, is basically free with your purchase. So $500 on the blender alone, then that's a $130 upgrade on that carafe. The spatula, what were you calling the spatula earlier? It's not a very manly thing to say, <laughs> but it's called a spectacula. A spectacula. Yes, yes. Spectacula, so spectacula. I always feel a little it's bit weird saying the, saying the name of it, but it, uh, <laughs> that it is a, it's a good name. It is. So, because it's spectacular. Well, what do you have going on over here, Shane? Which, by the way, if you see me in a two-shot walking away, it's not because Shane doesn't know his <laughs> stuff and he's not lovely. It has so much power and torque just to make it comfortable for our audio guys so their poor little ears aren't bleeding by the end of the show. <laughs> I walk away to kind of make their job a little easier. Absolutely. But, you know, the uh, noise usually uh, means power. It means power. <laughs> yeah, so what absolutely. are you up to over here? So what we're going to show you is a whole juice. Now, obviously, these blenders are very versatile. Yes. They can replace a bunch of kitchen appliances in your kitchen. Right. One of the major things that people use these machines for is to right. do whole fruit and vegetable oh, juicing. Yeah. In fact, Shane, that reminds me, Steve, do we still have the support? We used to have a still that shows what this replaces. Oh, I Not love there. you for that. Thank you. <laughs> so real quickly, this is what Shane was alluding to. It's your coffee grinder. It's your mixer. It's your food processor. It's a meat grinder. It's a soup maker. It's an ice cream machine, which by the way, when you see the ingredients that Shane puts in, I actually bought this because of the ice cream, but <laughs> I, we'll, I, I'm keeping that as my little surprise. We'll reveal that later. It's a margarita mixer. It's a juicer. And quite frankly, this is just only scratching the surface. Absolutely. So 
Absolutely. So even when you're talking about something as quote unquote simple as a smoothie, mm -hmm. you're going to get better results. That's why Blendtec is used in Absolutely. those smoothie shops, basically. Absolutely. You, you, you don't want to get clumps in your drink. No, you don't. So that's why restaurants trust us to be not only do you hundreds of blend cycles a day, but thousands every year without having a machine break down on Isn't them. Isn't that great? So the consistency, and, and by the way, it's an eight year warranty on these machines. That's incredible. If you look I didn't at get any that in my car. <gasps> oh, oh yeah. yeah right. <laughs> I didn't. I urge you to look at any appliance in your entire house and tell me if you can find anything with past a one year warranty. No kidding. This is an eight year warranty from top to bottom. It's no gimmicks. It's not just parts and warranty. It's no. on the entire machine. It is. Okay, so what are we doing next? We're going to do a whole juice now. You'll notice that I'm going to put the fuzz of the, of the kiwi in there too. Which so you're going to see yeah. me load some things in here. And the reason why I'm doing it is because a lot of that stuff has nutrition. Like, look at these melon seeds here. There's a lot of magnesium in those melon okay. seeds. There's a ton of protein in those flax, sure. in, in flax seeds and seeds in your, in your fruits. This is the pineapple with the core. Ooh, That's where pineapple. all the fiber is. Yes, it now, is. Now, the one thing that juicers do at home if you have a juicer is you're no, running all this you're stuff through. You're leaving the stems on? Oh, the stems are full of polyphenols Keep those and leaves chlorophyll. on there. We're being it's lazy. <laughs> okay. It's good for your immune system. It is indeed. Of okay. course, oranges, vitamin C. Now, the most important thing to remember with these machines is you don't have to assist the machine. Now, you notice that I'm not filling it up with a bunch of water. No. The machine is going to do its job and just blend so everything in. So normally here. when you see similar machines in this price point, they add water, because I have oh, to I add forgot. water, right? Okay. Gotta get that greens in there. See, now you've got three kids. Is this how you sneak spinach in their diet? Absolutely. They Once don't know. Once they got used to it, they didn't really care because I make a lot of green stuff. What they don't know can't hurt them basically. So this is how you get the veggies in, right? Absolutely. All right. Now, when you look at the design of the machine, you'll see that this is a square jar design. Yes. The reason why our blenders are square is because it creates a lot of activity on the inside of the jar. Sure. So when the material is spinning around, it's hitting a corner and forcing that material down, right. hitting a corner and forcing the material okay. down. So you're getting very, very smooth blends because you're getting more activity on the inside Sounds of the jar. Sounds good. And now, Shane, as you get ready to demonstrate, talk yes. about the panel. And then again, I'm going to move away because it's got <laughs> torque, it's got power, but what did you just do to engage So that? I just turned that on. This is a capacitive touchscreen display and all these little icons right here that you see are linked to computer programs and the machine is designed to run for you. So I don't have to fiddle around with that lever, Absolutely. that widget, which other commercial blenders, no disrespect, they were designed for chefs. I don't uh -huh. have, I want to press one button, just like my <laughs> microwave. I want that popcorn setting. I want that defrosting. <laughs> I want yeah. it all. We're basically. already busy enough. We we just need a, a, a machine to do Amen. what it was designed to do. Okay, so, so which one are you going to choose? So right on the touch screens right here, the icons are smoothie, there's ice cream and frozen yogurts, mm. there's whole juice, which is the button I'm about mm. to use, and then there's soup, service, and fondues, and then you have your manual speeds and a chopping and pulse button. Okay. So if you just want to chop your right. recipes and different things like that, you can use a pulse button. Now what I'm going to do here, you're stepping away, but I'm going to show the, something real quick. The blade is actually designed to force the material down, so when I start this off, to, I urge you not to do this at home, I'm going to leave the lid off for just for a few seconds so you can see how Which, this works. The first time that we did it, he, they freaked everybody out in the control room. They're like, <laughs> you gotta put that lid on. So here's the other cool thing. I, I, I kind of buried the lead. If you do a little YouTube search on blend tech, oh honey, you're gonna see it all. You're gonna Stuff see it that you probably won't be making for your kids or your grandkids, like golf clubs, golf balls, I mean, you name it. And we're not saying <laughs> to try to duplicate those efforts. Don't but the creator of Blendtec has yes. a whole online community where people they, they look to see what he's up to, absolutely, don't they? Absolutely, absolutely. We've had a half a billion views on just our Willow Blend videos. And don't show your kids, but they're blending up iPhones, rake handles, two by fours, golf clubs. Golf I clubs. Mean, everything you it's can insane. think of on the inside of the machine. Brandon, I know this is kind of a funny thing to show, but if you shoot both of us, now he, the first time I did this, I, look at I'm so far away. Shane is not holding the cover down, okay? Which is also very important yep. because it is it is so secure. Absolutely. You can aim, spray, walk away. You Set can load those head. ingredients in. Now notice, yep. it stopped on its own. It stopped, and remember, the only reason we're walking away is just because it's got torque. It's got, as Tim Allen would say, Absolutely. Rah, 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 you know, now, power. Now, the science behind these machines is called micronization. So the machine is capable of liquefying all those seeds, sure. the skins, the stems, everything that was on the fruits and vegetables that we placed in there, and everything is consistent. There's absolutely no clumps. None. Now what that means for a nutritional aspect is that parade. you're able to absorb everything that you're drinking. Sure. Okay. Cheers with that. Now, cheers, but I want Excellent. to remind you, there were strawberries with seeds, 
The cantaloupe had the seeds. Seeds on there the as well. The kiwi had the skin. So all of that. So all right, I'm I'm going in. Oh, that is yummy. That's Absolutely yummy. Wow. Right. Hey, before we do another demonstration, because this yeah. is one of my favorites. Okay. There are a couple things I want to talk about. Capacity and this direct drive. Now, one Absolutely. of the things that burns out other blenders, and part of the reason this can live up to a, a bartender or a, a, a used in smoothie shops, Absolutely. are some of the feature and design elements that you do. Can you describe Absolutely. those for us? So it's a direct drive armature. Now at home, I'll, I'll, I'll actually dare you to do this, but look at your current blender and yeah. look at the drive socket on the bottom of your blender yeah. and on, on the motor base. Now that drive socket will be a hardened plastic, plastic. or some sort of aluminum them with plastic right. around it. Right. Now those are built and designed to break if anything was too tough on the inside of the jar. Right. This machine right here will not break. Will not break. And the reason why we're able to do those crazy videos you were just talking about I with know. Tom Dixon is because of that drive shaft. We so don't build our blenders to break. Here are some of the features. So those are those pre-programmed cycles that Absolutely, you were talking yeah. about. So I don't have to think about it. Six-speed right. touch slider, so you can even get precise manual speeds if you want to use it manually as well. Sure. Okay, nice. So it's kind of like it's uber smart. It's like your cell phone, like your smartphone. <laughs> exactly, I mean, it really yeah. is. That's what's so cool. Smarter than me, that's for sure. <laughs> well, <laughs> listen, me as well for a lot of different reasons. Yeah. Easy to clean, of course, which is another thing that we like, whether it's juicing, and then we'll show you that graphic with all the things this replaces, which, by the way, is also very conservative. But I, I didn't want to leave. Oh, thank you, Steve coffee grinder, mixer, food processor, meat grinder, soup maker, ice cream, make ice cream, margarita maker, the juicer. We used to sell just margarita machines on the air here Absolutely. at HSN for $200. But talk about the blade as well. And then, of course, we're going to introduce to you our $130 freebie, that, that great Absolutely. little carafe. So the blade is a single wingtip blunt blade. It is not sharp. It's absolutely safe. So if I reach my hand inside the jar yeah. here, I will not hurt my Myself in any way. Yeah. It's 10 times starter. So at least our studies have shown that it's 10 times stronger than any of our competitors' blades. Oh, no kidding. So even though we're blending up hockey pucks and baseball bats, the blade doesn't get damaged. <laughs> right. So it's a very safe and blade. One of the things that I was surprised, even though this might look like a shorter profile to other blenders, yes. the, the carafe is designed, the square shape has reason, but it also has bigger capacity. Yes. So it allows us to be able to blend large portions, but never bog down the machine no. because the motor is big enough that it can handle any quantity that you in, throw out. In a smaller profile. Absolutely. Now, this also has no, like no, no, a, a different insert, yes. and you guys do that for a reason. Yes, yeah, so this is called a twister jar. It's one of the favorite accessories for Blendtec machines. Which normally Quite you simply, sell separately. Absolutely, they're $130 usually separately, so this is an excellent additive to, to, to tonight's value for yep. sure. Okay. Now the tines here, the reason why you use this this jar here is to do basically real thick or sticky things. Anything that would usually stick to the sidewalls of the jar, these tines serve as scrapers, yep. and they're going to scrape the jar okay. while we blend. So right. I'm going to get this right okay. out real so quick. So again, you touch that screen. I'm going to go ahead screen. and blend this while you go ahead Sounds and sock good. through it. Sounds good. And like, a, like and your smartphone. this is going to be 20 phone. seconds. It's going to be a nut seconds. butter in about 20 seconds. Okay, nut butter. Those could be cashews. Those could be almonds, honey, roasted peanuts, all of that. And remember, Remember, that carafe kind of helps it around. You can see Shane giving it a little extra goose there. But 20 seconds to your nut butters. And those designer nut butters in the health food store are a small fortune. Now, you didn't have to add oil or anything to that. That was there just was pure no nuts. There was no oil. In fact, this is actually honey nut roasted peanuts. Mm. So it's going to taste delicious, that's, that's for nice. sure. Now, if you look at the nut butters right here, I would lick the blade kind of like a mixer. I'm not even kidding. So okay. imagine if you have kids running home from school like myself. I, right. I'll throw chocolate chips in there for my kids. Oh, sure. You can do hazelnut with a little bit of uh, cocoa powder, like Ooh, the, like the store-bought stuff that's yummy, not very yummy, healthy yummy. for you. I'm going to use the spectacular here again. I never get used to saying that. I know, that's so Now, what's fun. funny about the Spectacular, too, is it does have a little kickstand on the bottom, so if you're right. doing things like nut butters, you can get everything out of there, and when you stick it down on the table, it keeps the, the top oh, of yeah. the I'm, I'm of just the spatula I'm not even messing around with the oh, bowl. Go I'm not going to lie. I'm going right you're in for like the me. kill. You're just like me. I just drink right out, the, right out of the craft itself. Oh, man, 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 man. Wow, that's the next that's thing we're going to do is one of the appliances that you see on that list mm. is... 
it's, it can be serving as a grinder or a mill. So if you wanna right. do something like coffee beans, grind your own coffee, it takes literally five or six seconds to grind sure. coffee. You can get it to the consistency, you can make a coarse grind, you can make a fine grind, whatever you want. Right. This is rice, I'm gonna grind it into rice flour. Now you can do up to four cups at a time. I'm only gonna put a little bit of rice in here okay. because I wanna show you how this blade works and the power of the machine. Literally, you're gonna see this blade lift all this rice right off the ground. Awesome. It's a pretty impressive little thing, it, but we're gonna get is. a great grind on this. On this. Uh, but, now how you grind is just use your manual speeds. I'm gonna crank it right up to okay. top speed. And it takes literally seconds. And if you do have someone who's gluten intolerant or gluten sensitive, boy oh boy, those gluten-free flours are, they're expensive. Shelf life too. They, they do. Absolutely. And what's interesting is, well, Kelly Dietering is coming up with our air fryer in moments. Now we're putting chicken wings or chicken nuggets back on the menu. So you can create your own coatings Absolutely. that are gluten free as well. And it is like dust. Well, I mean, you can, seriously. I mean, if you look at this consistency here, I'm just going to move these cups out of the way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is a perfect rice flour. So if you yep. have gluten free bacon mixes that you're trying to get done. Now, if this was a whole wheat or anything like that, yeah. you can fill that consistency. That's actually rice flour for nice. even rice cereal for if you have a baby. Wow. You can make your baby foods on the inside perfect. of the machine like a breeze. That was the original reason why I purchased my machine. Okay, Shane, you look like a guy who works out. So if you're ready, we're going to do some shopping cardio. Okay. You've got nine minutes left. Can we, Excellent. Can we do pesto, soup, and ice cream in that time? You know what? I think we can. Let's He's do it. up for the challenge, ladies and gentlemen. I right. like it. A man of action. We're going to do the soup first. Now, what you have in here, a bunch of tomatoes. There's a big chunk of cheddar cheese, some carrots, some onions, some water. You can even put some spices in there. Ooh. Now, the soup program is kind of unique. Once again, if you've never seen these machines, the soup program works off of friction, just kind of like rubbing your hands together okay. to create heat. Because there's no heating element. Absolutely. Okay. So it's just the speed of the motor and the blade gotcha. that's going to create enough friction. And again, we moved over chocolates. to the side because it's got torque, guys. Yeah, it's and this is power. a three minute blend too, so yes. it runs a little bit longer as Sounds well. Sounds good. So I'm gonna use the soup, syrups, and fondues program, and that's a three minute cycle. Awesome. Well, well that's going over there. Okay, as we do that, you ready to demonstrate something else for Let's us? Let's do this ice cream, how about oh, that? perfect, okay. okay. So, so we might actually move, if we could guys, the soup off to the side, just because it takes uh, three minutes. That's and nice. now, that you have been this waiting ice cream. for. Now, just to premise this, if you want to make your ice cream naughty, you can make them naughty. I'm going to make a nice ice cream because, you, like you said, it's I, I kind of like night. to, I like to change gonna, things up. We're going to err on the side of, 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 <laughs> of you caution. know, caution. All okay. right, so now you have to remember this is your $130 carafe for free. What do you get Absolutely. in there, Shane? So I've got a half of an avocado on the bottom. Gotcha. I've got some protein powder, a little bit of agave, and I'm also going to place a little bit of peppermint extract in here. Oh, this is going to be a love, mint ice cream. I love Now, it peppermint. tastes like a gelato. But look at what the ingredients are in there. That's just some avocado, spinach. Okay. And then we're going to just add some ice, and the twister jar is going to do the rest. Right. Now, if you had some chocolate chips as well, we could throw chocolate chips in there. That's There's the just a bunch part, of different right? things. Yeah, Actually, if you want to no, be a little bit naughty. Chocolate is good. You know, a lot of antioxidants. <laughs> I mean, hey, I'm not knocking chocolate, I'll tell you right now. Absolutely. Okay. Remember, that's where you use that special, almost like stir top thingy. <laughs> Once it starts getting thick. I'm just gonna go ahead and twist. Absolutely, so once it starts getting thick, you just give it a little, you know, twister assist, if you will. And I'm telling you, the ice cream alone will pay for the purchase. Now remember, you hear noise, because it's got torque. It's got torque, which is important, and that's why juice bars and smoothie bars and bartenders, that's why Blendtec has been the professional's choice. You know that took you Look seconds. That, that oh, for heaven's sake. Might oh. as well toss it over my head a little bit. <laughs> Our makeup artist is just in here. It's like, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Here's the thing, though, and Steve, if it's okay, I'd love to show how few of these we have remaining. This is Shane's okay. last show. It is the only airing of birthday month. Uh, which color will go first? Orchid and the polar white, there are the last 30. So that orchid and that polar white, last 30. Oh, that Check looks that like out. it came from Italy. I mean, that does look like gelato. <laughs> oh, for heaven's sake. I wanna try some of that too. Do you know what? That peppermint just makes it pop. <gasps> yeah, I put a little bit of chocolate chips in there and it's oh, unbelievable. Wow, that's like mint chocolate chip yeah. ice cream. That yeah. is so good. All right. So you dared me to something, so we're gonna I go to the next thing. We're I gonna threw use down the gauntlet. Jar again. I'm not we're afraid. Make a pesto. Now this is a this is a pesto with a little bit of avocado on it. Okay. And this is literally gonna be about 15 seconds or less. <laughs> it's gonna be very, very quick. 15 seconds to pesto? I mean, come on. 
There is a reason that this is the professional smoothie bars choice. And we're done. This is, I mean, honest to gosh, that tastes like that pesto in seconds. That is Now look cuckoo. at this. So we already had that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, five your pasta, minutes your or sauces. sellout. So five minutes or sellout. Now, you ready for a little <laughs> naughty? Oh, we're, we're gonna go to the margaritas. We're gonna get hopped up here. Naughty time! <laughs> <laughs> Bring it on! After I throw the ice all over the place, okay. right? I'm getting but, a little bit too excited. See, I know, we're making it, we're, I'm setting them up for you, Shane. You're knocking them out of the park. But we used to sell margarita makers here at HSN for three. Now, Walking away, and my, even my producers Steve, Steve and Shane worked together for the first time last night. As uh, this is Shane's first visit with us, and our producer said it freaked me out, and I said the same thing because when I worked with Blendtec, I'm like, you can't, you have to babysit it. Shane, what are you working on now while the mar margarita is uh, going? I figured I'd multitask real quick. Why not? And I'm gonna make a brownie. A brownie. So, yes. It, so once again. We just made all these things, replaced all these different appliances. Now we're going to attack a mixer because you can use the machine as a mixer as well. Absolutely. So here's what here's one of the reasons that I got the blend tech because I think for a lot of us out there, we're trying to consolidate when it comes to the appliances in our home. And remember, it's got torque. That's why we kind of back away because it's got the same kind of power. Okay, the fact Shane actually. where you don't have to worry about it, you know, spraying things into the atmosphere, so to speak. <laughs> Absolutely. Real quick question. What's, yes. did you, which setting did you use on the margarita? So I just used a smoothie mix, smoothie. smoothie button right there, which is great for frozen drinks and icy drinks as well. Okay. Now, once again, go ahead and look at the consistency of this. All the ice is completely blended. If you go to a bar, the reason why they use Blendtex is right. because of the consistency of what it's able to do with ice. So you can get a perfect margarita. You can really throw whatever type of dense ingredients into the yeah. jar. You never have so to worry about if it's going to break your blade, break your motor. No. I mean, if you're using this as a mixer, we we sell mixers for $300 here at HSN. This is kind of a producer request. My producer, Steve, has been on a real health kick uh, lately. Almond milk that I can customize, right? Yes. Yeah. So we just soak the almonds overnight. You just add four cups of water, a little bit of vanilla, oh. and we're going to go ahead and make almond milk. You can Ooh, make rice milk. You can make yeah. soy milk. You can make coconut milk. You can make any type can of I milk alternative that you want almond to. Milk? Chocolate almond <gasps> milk too. Oh, Why not? I'm in. Chocolate almond milk, I mean. So, <laughs> just throw some cocoa powder Just a there. little cocoa powder. Absolutely. So notice again, all Shane is doing, it's a touch screen, just like your smartphone, just like your cell phone, and that engages it, and all of those pre-programmed functionality. This is Shane's only appearance of the birthday month. And Steve, if we could show the quantity left again, we have the final 700. If you want that polar white, uh, actually 10 of them remain, and then 30 of the orchid. And I think the the turquoise with the white is also, or the sea foam with the white is also very limited at this point. And then, wow! I like it. You're, are you going for another smoothie, or what are you doing over there? We're going to make another ice cream, but another. we're going to do it in this jar instead. Okay, so it looks like you've got frozen blueberries. Is that yeah, there's frozen blueberries, some cream down on the bottom, okay. and a little bit of agave. agave. And then we have uh, protein powder. Protein powder. And then frozen blueberries. And frozen blueberries. And Absolutely. So remember, it's replacing your mixer, your meat grinder, your margarita maker. It's a soup maker, which after this, Shane, I mean, maybe we should show the steam from the soup, too, before oh, we Oh, absolutely. We before completely we lose forgot it. about that soup, didn't we? See, look, at I'm, I'm, I'm being all healthy. Don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't tell anybody, because honest to goodness, that would be a first, even for me. So... We have soup, we have smoothies, we have ice cream, you can grind meat. Oh, absolutely. Ask and you shall receive. It is now, a soup maker. Right here, if you can zoom in on this, because you'll okay. see. And you know what, Shannon? That was only about three minutes, and you can crew. see all the, so, all the steam rolling all right. out the machine. Awesome. So if you can now, see that's that that's a perfect steam. temperature. That's going to be about well, 125 okay, degrees. Not because then I can get closer to you. <laughs> so, so 
know that they can see the steam. Absolutely. So uh, you name I'm it. I'm come back over here I guess because from, that's where we have our soup bowls. So from soup to nuts, this does it all. There are fewer than 700 to go around. And Brandon, I know we're almost out of time, but maybe we can even do like a quick pan over the gorgeousness that we have created. We might Absolutely. even have time for hummus, but you can see we did that great green smoothie, homemade honey peanut butter, gluten-free rice, soup that we didn't have to babysit, this chocolate, I mean, it's like, it, yeah, it's like a chocolate chip ice cream, <laughs> which is cuckoo good. Homemade pesto, margarita maker, it's a mixer. Then you did your own vanilla or almond, uh, milk. almond milk. Absolutely. And then, do Steve, are we, are we out? Okay, let's, let's fire them up. Let's, let's see what it. we can do. Let's get this ice cream okay. done real quick. So Should remember, we go two at the same time. Why not? <laughs> we're, we're, right, yeah, I'm liking this. this I'm liking how we're go rolling challenge, with this. So I've got to go ahead and meet it. See, I, you are a man up for the challenge. I like that. So that so we've got hummus and ice cream going. And even though Shane is staying next to the blend tag, he wouldn't have to. So is I got so my we, ice we're cream already. In about 20 seconds. I didn't seconds. think you could do it. Not now, that I haven't been impressed already. I think the frozen berries just melted a little bit, so it's it's more of like yeah, a smoothie. Right. See, that's the only thing with the temperature. We would have had a little bit more exactly, because right? with the studio temperature, if sometimes we don't get to the ice cream right away, yeah. listen, honey, it's still good. Well, I can tell you what. If you actually just want to throw that into the freezer, sure. of course, it would just set up really and nicely then in the freezer. Even too. our producer Steve was all crazy about that hummus. And was oh, that just our garbanzo beans things. and what else? That's garbanzo beans, a little bit of red pepper. Correct. Crushed. Nice. And I believe we have a little bit of spices in there too. Yep. I'm using the spectacular once again to get it out of the jar. That was a special you design know how much I love though, right? Say, uh, I know. Just say it's that just word. fun to say. So <laughs> remember, absolutely. it is your final and only show of birthday. We include a bunch of bonuses, not the least of which is that additional carafe that Blendtec always sells separately. That's a $130 value. There is a small, there's a recipe booklet included, but there's a yes. huge community for Blendtec very online. Big community and they're very huge. Huge. They're very communicative. Y yes, they are. Yes, They're very they vocal, well. but they all love it. And well, they, they share recipes back I and know, forth. There's a lot of videos, sure. ideas. If you go to blendtech.com, too, yep. and you look at all the recipes, there's about 500 different recipes and videos. Well, welcome to the family, Shane. All right. Good to thank have you, your, Shannon. Thank you for living up to my challenge. Uh, I appreciate I'm impressed. That. Thank you, guys. I was burning calories just watching you. <laughs> <laughs>